Okay, let's try some examples on your own. Number one, how many megapixels are required to capture an image that is 12 inches by 7 inches that the user only wants to print on paper? Take a minute to calculate this on your own. When you're ready, push play again, and I'll go through the answer. Okay, so we're going to go back to our original formula. So we'll take the width times the resolution. In this case, we must decide that because it's going to be printed on paper with ink, that the resolution is 300. So 12 times 300 is 3,600 pixels across. By 7 times 300 is 2,100 pixels tall. When we multiply the two of those together, it comes out to 7,560,000. So this would create or would require an image that has 7.56 megapixels. Let's do one more example. How many megapixels are required to capture an image that is 10 inches across and 8 inches tall that will be displayed on a digital picture frame? Take a minute to try this on your own. Push play when you're ready to see the answer. Okay, so this requires us to do a couple things. First, we have to decide what resolution a digital picture frame would be. So a digital picture frame is a display device. It's digital. Uh, so the resolution will be 72. So going back to our formula, 10 inches times 72 resolution creates an image that's 720 pixels across. And 8 times 72 creates an image that is 576 pixels tall. When you multiply those together, you need 414,720 pixels or 0.42 megapixels in your camera. So basically, any camera can capture this. Your phone from five years ago could probably capture a 0.42 megapixel image. Uh, that is all I have for the first lesson for this week. Uh, what is next? You should complete your homework and your quiz associated with resolution and image size, and then you should move on to the next lecture.